Spreader setting and accuracy is important to me because it's, it's protecting my investment, it's protecting the environment and it's, it's protecting my pride and, and passion as a good farmer. I farm here in a little village in North Lincolnshire called Scotton. My grandfather came down in 1957 and bought the farm. My father carried on farming and I'm, I'm the third generation on this farm. I was always going to be a farmer. There was never any choice. I've driven tractors since I was six years old. I've learnt the ropes from my father, watched the, him work in the fields and everything, been taught by him and yeah, there, was, there was never a question that I would do anything other than be a farmer. I'm proud to be a farmer because I'm out in the soil and the, and the, and the fields every day. I'm proud to be a farmer because I'm providing food for people. I'm proud for a, to be a farmer because I'm, I'm looking after the environment in the best possible way I can. I'm just proud to be a farmer. I think setting a spreader up is, a, is time and money well spent. It's, you know, it's protecting my uh, investment, it's protecting the environment, it's protecting the ecological value of the crop. I need to set the spreader up really because I've, I've spent a lot of investment in the spreader itself and the tractor. I've spent a lot of investment on the fertiliser. I need to know I'm putting it in the right place at the right time. So making sure your spreader settings are set up correctly will give you a nice even yield um, and this is important not only for harvest because you will be able to harvest everything evenly but also your yield will be even across the whole field. The thing with spreader settings is that people do get the misconception that it's time consuming and they can do it whenever they want to. You don't have to do the spreader settings the day that you, you, know, you go out. You can set your spreader up at any time you like. You can go into the field now when there's nothing on get the spread inch, write them down, and then you're all ready to go when the time's ready. Well, the, the end result of all of this is, is going to be that, you know, the fact that I'm going to get better, higher yields, more return on investment. It just makes sense. It makes sense financially to do this job. There are times I wish I had a quiet job at, at times, yeah, yeah, but when, when the wind's coming past me at 100 miles an hour and it's there's cold and rain and frost and, and we still have to be out in it, but no. No, I still, I still go home at night and, and thank I'm a farmer. Yeah.